Hello everyone, this is Jeremy from Dust3D. Dust3D is a 3D modeling software for quick making game assets. It's fully open sourced, GitHub link in the description. In this video, I will introduce you what happened in this week and show you the full progress of mod, rig and animate of a low poly Sega at the end. First, Aaron suggested a bundle every week hashtag for 10 minutes every day on Dust3D form. Instead of modeling random things, make every week's mods as a bundle. Thanks for the suggestion. Here, Aaron is a board member from MSIS Engine. It's a Rust language based game engine. You can check the link in the description below. Sounds like a good idea. Let's see how it goes. Lighthouse Sega Palm Tree. Wind turbines, house, and uh, deck chair. Second, let's see some comments from my last dev log video. First comment by Patricia Soto. Can a detailed motorcycle be modeled in this software? Thanks for asking. It's a yes for the details scale of it. An indie game. I did a bicycle before, so I'm pretty sure you can do it in case you have a good reference picture. Second command by Trinsha Ten. I've been following Duster 3D for a while, but I'm confused. Are you still on the track of making games, or you are simply providing the developers good free tool and something from the tool, or this is just something you want to be do besides your job? I found you on Twitter and Facebook. Do you use them? Yes, I'm still on the track of making games. That's re the reason why I made this tool. I'm quite enjoy. I have a hobby of making games and have such a sad project. I'm active on Twitter. Please follow me if you want to see my fresh daily mods. And if you are actually a game developer or interested in game making, I will definitely follow back. Thanks for the comments. Lastly, what's the updates on the software? There are more buttons on post editor. Sometimes it's quite hard to see the skinny tone joints, so I add the dark and the bright slider. slider. Also, it's very hard to select a different side of the skinny tone before now. But now you can click each of the button to hide or show each part. This is right side, mid side, left side. And uh, there's an advanced setting button being added with a parameter height adjustment scale. What does this mean? The post generator will automatically treat the lowest coordinates as the ground. So it works for most of the animals, but there is no ground for bird. If we apply the same logic, the fly animation will look quite bumpy. This parameter is to offset the bumpy offset, but the bumpy effect. You can see how it will be used in the later demo. Okay, that's the week. Thank you all. Please enjoy the full progress of the model, rig, and animate of the of the Sega. And don't forget, don't, don't forget the subscribe and the like button. See you next time.